Hi friends, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. So today, I I really don't have that much going on here. I'm just finishing work um, for today. So today is Monday. It is actually the last day of February and the end of Black History Month. But you know every month is Black History Month actually. So what am I doing? I... During my lunch break today, I went to Lidl and I went to get some, um, this corn salsa that I had been craving. It is so good. It's a little spicy, but it is delicious. And I needed some tortilla chips. I thought that was going to be my lunch today. <laughs> it wasn't, but I want to show you the salsa and while I was in there, they had some of the most beautiful tulips. And so, you know, tulips have been like my flower of choice lately. You know, this is the time tulips usually um, begin to sprout and you begin to see them out. I was out today and I saw all the dogwoods beginning to blossom, the real pretty pink and white dogwood blossoms. And so, you know, that also means pollen season. So if you have allergies, this is not your time. Um, but these tulips were gorgeous they also have some really nice orchids too and i was thinking about getting a live orchid also um and i might do that on my next trip there but i have come to find out um that the two best places for me to get tulips well three Publix, Lidl is now beautiful because the, the um, tulips that i actually have they are gorgeous and target so um i'm gonna get rid of my tulips that i had from last week and replace them with these tulips for this week and um the the thing about it was the prices at lidl that's moogie the prices for the tulips at lidl they were only 5.99 and those were i caught the first tulips that i shared with you guys for the galentines the red ones those were at Publix. They had them actually two for ten dollars, so around the same amount of uh, same price. But yes, and then the ones at Target, they were like eight dollars. So I think Lidl has beat out Target, but they have these beautiful, beautiful colors. Did not pull out my camera so that I could show you, but um, y'all know tulips. But I'm gonna go and get my tulips. We are. Uh, I have to film for the upcoming um pajama party the pajama jam i still don't know what i'm gonna name it yet but i'm i'm gonna film um an invite for that and i think that's gonna be so much fun i'm really excited about it been talking about um the concept and you know get everything together with the other ladies so um i'm gonna film that and i'm i'm actually going to make me something to drink and i think I want one of the uh, it's the coconut beverage from Lidl. They generally bring it out around this time. This is the bottle that I had from last year. And so I'm going to have that because I feel like I want something a little bit festive. So I'm going to go upstairs and get the flowers and um, bring them back down here. And then we're going to go ahead, trim those, and we're going to put them in a the vase. So come on.
so this is so good guys mm. next thing i want to do quickly is i want to do this quick little arrangement and i think that's going to be us for today guys mm. i need to go upstairs and edit the video i do have um i did go by target and so I'm going to show you some things that I saw in Target. And um, so you have a quick little shop with me. And then we will be done with the day. So while we're at it right now, let's do this quick little arrangement. Another floral um, centerpiece that I want to put here in the house. Well, a little floral accent that I'm going to put here in the house. So let's go. decorate this side table here and I want to create a really nice floor arrangement so I'm going to use this gold vase on this pedestal stand here and that gives it a lot of height these two do not go together I just put them together and I like how they look and it brings in the gold and the black elements that I use here in my home then I am using this alabaster vase I used a lot of this last year during the spring and summer months and so I absolutely love it and it plays on the creams and the white textures and colors that are in this space as well. Then we are utilizing this gold metal leaf here to bring some more gold accents to this area. So during the spring and summer months I like to kick off the season with creating some type of arrangement. And so this arrangement on this table is gonna be one very simple, and then the second one's gonna be a little bit more elaborate. So in this white alabaster vase here, I am using some faux pompous and wheat grasses. Love the creamy texture of this. I think it's very airy and it emulates what you can begin to see out outside in nature um, currently. And then we will go, go ahead and start building on our arrangement for the larger um, face here. So because it's tall and I want to bring your eyes up and so everything will be so flat, I have a mixture of these faux roses from Hobby Lobby as well as these um, stems here that have little buds on them. And so I think they emulate what is actually going on outside because all of the 
um, leaves and florals are blooming, especially here in Georgia. You're beginning to see a lot of the dogwoods blooming. And the tulips here are perfect because this is the time that you begin to see a lot of the tulips pop up in people's yards as well as on the sides of the street. So I thought these would be perfect for this area. So doing a simple little arrangement to direct the um, florals as in, um, in directions where it would naturally hang, I think um, makes it look a lot lifelike as well as keeping a lot of the greenery on. And then I'm beginning to put some of the bud stems into this arrangement and it all comes together very beautifully. So guys, that is going to be the end of today's vlog. I hope you all enjoyed it, spending some time with me, going to Target. I'm picking up some beautiful tulips as well as creating this arrangement. Come back and I will be sharing with you how I am beginning on adding accents to the home, using items that you already have, just switching things around to give yourself a new look. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. If you like what you've seen, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads. Also, come on over and check me out on my Instagram. You can find me over there at Wani's house. Hit the follow button and then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at Wani's house. All right, guys. So I'm about to go. But before I do, you know what I always say. The next time you're in town, you can always stop by Wani's house and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.